Iron Bowl is just three days away. I spoke with some Chico High Panthers the other day, and they're excited for game time. In the air and on the ground, the Chico High Panthers are dominating the football field. Kids working hard. They, they have a drive. They want to be good. We're blessed with some athleticism, you know, on the edges and at the running back positions. And, uh, you know, we just keep working every week to get better. Um, our defense is playing really well lately. You know, we've had two shutouts in a row. After coming off last year's games, you know, we, we have a little chip on our shoulder and we want, to do, we want to win some games. The Panthers sit atop of the Eastern Athletic League at 3-0 and and 7-1 and overall. And now they're gearing up to play the defending D2 state champions at Pleasant Valley High in the Almond Bowl. Vikings are a, a very big physical team. And, you know, I expect uh, them to come out and play hard. I mean... They might be one game behind us right now, but they're right there, and I know that they're going to want to, um, you know, make a jump in the standings. So they're they're going to come out fired up, and so we got to match that intensity and and play our best. And he believes the number one seed in the championship are at stake. I feel pretty great. It's going to be a challenge. They got a lot of good skill guys that can match up with us, but for our offense, we have we can uh, have an air show because we got a lot of uh, vertical threats. Marvelous Owens already preparing his touchdown dance. He's one of those threats. Alongside Abe Del Real and Jalen Johnson, they've combined for 22 touchdowns in seven games. And quarterback Jake Hammond leading that pack with over 1,100 passing yards. I think I'm feeling more excited than nervous and just super ready for it. Since we had a bye week last week, we've been just trying to maintain our focus and uh, yeah, just stay locked in. It is a big game, and there's a lot of pageantry and a lot of uh, excess, you know, going on that's outside of the game. So I'm trying to keep, just get my kids to focus and hone in on on the football part of it. Um, you know, we're the entertainment, so we got to make sure we uh, we play well. All right, game time set at 7:30. If you don't have tickets, go buy your tickets. Also, the car giveaway raffle tickets are still on sale. You can head to our website at Action News now under the local sports tab for more information on that. So I was mentioning Vanessa earlier today. I was on the PV campus to buy my tickets for the Ammon Bowl, right? Mm -hmm. And everybody's dressed in red, and PV colors, of course, are blue. I mean, what is going on? And I was told that they wear today's Jinx Day, so wow. they wore red for Jinx Day, and so I thought that was kind of funny. And you had a story of your own yeah. about the players. One of the athletes, Marvelous Owens, he was telling me that it's a mental game for him, so he stays off social media. He doesn't participate in any of the spirit week that's going on because he just wants to stay focused. So I thought that was really interesting. Yeah, yeah it's boy, it's, it's, it's big. It's a big it game. It is big. I'm excited. Yeah. 49 <laughs> hours away from right now. I know, right? Yeah. Wow, that's Here we good go. enough. <laughs> Thanks, Vanessa. Well, 